hello everyone welcome once again to think tank tv now recall that we have always said we are going to be that media station that will always constructively criticize those political class who do bad and also intentionally appreciate them when they do good now why did we decide to do that it's simple it's simply because the reason why we constructively criticize these politicians who do bad is not necessarily because we have anything against them but it's because we want our society to become a better place now despite being an alleged emperor like many have called barrister is in one year some week the former governor of river state by virtue of all the shenanigans that have been happening in river states today we want to give him his flowers for the good job he has been doing in the federal capital territory yes recall that president bola ahmed sinubu just praised him for being one of his most hard-working ministers and i like us to showcase some of the good works he has been doing in the federal capital territory as information obviously has it that yes on wiki has been working day and night like most of the projects in the federal capital territory has been on even during the weekends a friend of mine called me the other day and was saying that she was actually driving on a sunday and she saw that construction work was going on seriously and massively and she said that this year mr project is actually doing so well and i thought to at least appreciate him despite the fact that we have also been criticizing him in the past like i said not because we have any personal sentiments against him but it's simply because we want our political class to do well for the betterment of our society and of course that's what the media should be where the media is going to be not taking any sides but to say it how it is regardless of what people would say now for us to call a spade a spade i'm going to be taking you through some of the projects that yes wiki has done in the federal capital territory ranging from asukoro to apo to good luck jonathan expressway to gaki to area 3 reports has it that this guy has done very well so far like the projects are going on concurrently like you can see in the video right now and uh, i've always known yes and wiki to be a, an energetic man that can walk and walk and walk regardless of his bad side and of course that is what a city should be and the truth is that nigerians would always commend you when they see you doing good and the reason why most nigerians are actually criticizing the government is not necessarily because they don't like them but it's simply because they want uh, the gov the political class to do well and ensure that they give the people the dividend of democracy now like i posted a video yesterday about um, a video that was posted by udumeje the prophet in nigeria where he was saying that most of the political class and the so-called professors in nigeria are not educated and the reasons why he actually said that you can see it for yourself that that's exactly what we're saying that this is what we expect from the political class that they should be able to come out and do what they see when they keep traveling to most of these advanced nations and that's why i intentionally want to do this good video to appreciate you some weekend and to showcase the good work he's doing in the federal capital territory yes a lot of projects has been ongoing in these areas but there's another area i want to bring to the awareness of the political class especially the apc government in nigeria it is the area of the human capital development i've seen a lot of projects going on but i want i want them to look towards the area of developing humans like skill acquisition scholarships and other things that would empower human beings like i used to hear from one man that used to see, a wise man that once said that building uh, bridges 
rail lines cannot be compared to building a man that when you build a man you have actually built a society because when you build a society when you build bridges when you build all these things if the people are not educated and are not transformed in their mind they themselves are the people that will destroy this project so it's important for the apc government and the bola metunibus government to also look towards the area of human capital development scholarships training for young nigerians to get them equipped for the future that will be coming and another area is the area of creation of companies that will bring about jobs a lot of nigerians have been jackpying like you can see, you, you know about it they've been leaving the shores of nigeria uh, uh, by virtue of what we call the brain drain going to other other communities other nations outside the shores of nigeria all in a search for a better life and this is simply because there are no job opportunities for them and we believe that regardless of the good roads these projects that the federal government is doing people should or the government should also look at the importance of create setting up companies setting up organizations and parasitals that will bring about job opportunities for young persons very important and another very critical area is the area of providing loans for msmes small medium skill industries it's very critical that the government ensures they look towards this area we heard in recent days that the central bank of, of nigeria went ahead to increase interest rates and i was wondering how does the tinubu government actually intend to stabilize the economy when they are going ahead to increase the interest rate of, of, of um, the nigerian people how can small scale industries assess businesses how can they go ahead to assess loans to be able to power businesses because of course if these small medium scale industries do not have single digit interests it's going to be very difficult for the gdp of nigeria to to skyrocket because definitely if they don't have these small scale uh, single interest loans small businesses are not going to be thriving just like i also heard yesterday that president bala metinubu approved single digit interest loans for media firms in nigeria and a lot of people were laughing like is that the way he wants to appease the media is that the way he wants to appease the media from all the cyber bullying and all that but critically it's important because these small medium scale industries are very important for the gdp of any country to be able to skyrocket so these are the areas i think the Bola Metinibus administration must also look into. And lastly, Bola, um, the Minister of the Federal Capital Territory, like I said, today we want to give him his flowers for the good job he's been doing in Abuja, regardless of all the shenanigans in River State. He's also a man that is very energetic and can do the job if you give it to him. So these are some of the road projects that he has been doing in the Federal Capital Territory and a lot of people have been speaking good about him for the good things he's been doing and that is why we intentionally thought to bring it to you. Please, I'd like you to also go to the comment section and drop your thoughts. Let's get to know what you think. If you're in Abuja currently, also do well to let us know what the development is like in your area. Let us know if the development is not getting to your area and if you think that the government should be able to extend it to your area please do also drop it in the comment section as we are here to continually serve you please i like you to intentionally do what to share this video to those you think would want to know the current development like i said as much as we criticize the government when they do wrong we should also do well to appreciate them so that this can encourage them to keep doing more for the betterment of nigeria as a nation Many thanks indeed to all our viewers who have always been there to watch our videos, to like it, to share it. We keep seeing hundreds of shares. We really do not take it lightly. We appreciate you for the good work you do and the, the, the patronage for you to continually watch our channel. Reco remember again, my name is Moses and I'm shooting this video from Think Tank TV. Many thanks indeed. See you on our next video. Bye for now.